Hi, I'm Jen. Each year, I like to talk about data analyst skills to learn for the next year. Here are my top data analyst skills to learn in 2021. I've talked lots in the past about key data analyst skills that any analyst should have, and I even have an ebook that goes into depth on all of them and resources for learning them. Those five skills are math, programming, data visualization, communication, and problem solving. Nothing has changed here. I'd still consider those the top five core skills that any data analyst should have. They're not the only skills that are useful to a data analyst though. So let's look at three data analyst skills to learn in 2021 that will make you a more effective analyst. The first skill is project management or project organization. As a data analyst, you don't need the same level of project management skill and expertise as someone that is a project manager or PMP certified, but you will find that being familiar with how projects run can help you be more effective as an analyst. As an analyst, most of us often run our own mini projects, so having an idea of how projects typically function can be really useful and it can help keep you organized. And for many of you, and for me, I often am a participant in a larger project that's happening, bringing in the element of the data and analytics perspective. So understanding how you fit in the entire project and how to really integrate your knowledge into that project setting can be really useful. Many organizations have some sort of shared project management tool. For a lot of companies, especially if they're working on IT related topics, that's going to be Jira, but Jira is used for many different applications. Other companies use tools like Trello, Asana, and whatnot to manage their projects. I did a video recently on the two project management tools that I really like for analytics, which I'll link so that you can go check it out. The second skill for 2021 is programming language or no-code analytics. What kind of languages or no-code, low-code analytics tools like Tableau and Power BI do you know? Where do you have shortcomings? What are skills that you need to build? If you have knowledge of one of these tools, but it's not that extensive, look at how you can improve those skills to make you more effective in your job every day. If you already feel like you've mastered the tools that you're using or the language you're using, what else could you add? Should you add a second language? Should you supplement your language, programming language skills for analytics with a no-code or low-code tool like Tableau or Power BI? If you're using Tableau or Power BI and don't know how to code, even learning a small amount of coding can help you do a lot more in those applications. Don't think of it as you have to master Python or not use Python. Look at how you could incorporate little bits of that knowledge to make you more effective using one of those low-code platforms. The third data analyst skill to learn in 2021 is how to think about problems. Very defined problems are a great way to start learning a new skill. They create a lot of structure and tell you about what your limitations are, what information you need. But taking this to the next level and actually using these skills in a job for most people means a lot more ambiguity. There's a lot less that's defined. Your data sources are much dirtier. The objectives of the business may not be as clear, or at least your role in them may not be as clear. And being able to know how to think about problems really is an asset for you as an analyst. Otherwise, you end up stuck more in typically reporting type roles where you can generate reports really well. You can do things when someone tells you, here's exactly what I need from you and here's the sources you'll use, but that's not great for your long-term career growth. Being able to think about problems and solve problems in more unstable settings is really an asset to any analyst. My course, Think Like an Analyst, deals specifically with this topic. You can see more about it with a link down in the description. Those are my top three data analyst skills to learn in 2021. What skill are you planning to work on this year? Let me know down in the comments. I'm curious to hear what your focus is. Thanks so much for watching. I'll see you next week.